So today I want to talk about what are we hungry for? Are we hungry for Jesus or are we hungry for other things? If we're hungry for Jesus, then we'll constantly be seeking His will. God, what do you want in this situation? I want what you want, God. I want to please you. I want to follow you. But if our hunger is for other things like relationships or affirmation or money or success, this is what we also will be basing our decisions on. Think about what you do when you're hungry. You seek to find food until you get it. And along the way, you could get grumpy or angry or... <laughs> And this is the same when we're not truly hungering for Jesus. And I do think that we could have a, a part of us is hungry for Jesus, but a part of us can still be hungry for relationship or affirmation or attention. And we'll seek things of God, but also strive to fulfill that other part of us, to fulfill what we're lacking. And it's those places that we need to surrender to the Lord, that we need to daily give to Him and let Him fill those places. What we feed on is what we'll hunger for, so we have to feed on Him daily. And you know, sometimes it's hard to see how God can fill that area when we're so, we're so hungry. But if we surrender it to Him, He will take it and He will replace it with Himself because He is enough. And so let's strive to give Him those places, to at first acknowledge the fact that we have hunger in these other places, and to just give it to Him and press through. And I know it can be hard in the beginning, but eventually He just comes and He satisfies every area of us. It says in the Word, if you draw near to God, that He will draw near to you. And so take that scripture and realize that as I draw near to Him, He will draw near to me. And we'll find that He'll not only fill those voids, but it'll be better than what you thought you wanted. And so let Him fulfill you today so that you can not only feel complete in Him, but to make the right decisions and walk the path that He has.